Hey guys, it's Hi Felicia, not Hi Felicia. Hey guys, the video is starting off like this because I thought I recorded um, myself um, showing you the catfish and putting the buttermilk on top of it as well as um, getting ready to um, make some twice loaded baked potatoes. So I put showed the potatoes and putting it in the oven and everything, but um, looks like <laughs> I didn't press record. So hey guys, enjoy so the rest of the video. And the catfish has been sitting in here for about 10 or 15 minutes so now i am opening up that bama that bama fish fry and this is the 19.4 ounce this is the bigger one um wow, look, at, look at the seasonings in there you do not need any seasoning it is all oh it is all in there So, I want that oil nice and hot. So the only thing that we have to do is grab oh, the coats. Look at that. Perfection. Perfection, guys. Perfection. Can that big catfish fit in there? You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to take what I was gonna take the scissors that conveniently broke. Why do they, you know, these things do not, here it is. So that's what I'm going to do. So I went to the fish market and I said, sweat. And she said, oh, catfish. I said, no, sway. Can I have, do you have sway filet? She said, we have catfish. It's the same thing. But when I went online, there are some differences with sway and catfish. They're similar, but they're still different. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna see because I really don't care for catfish. Oh y'all, here we go. Okay, that's a, gonna be a weird piece. I'm gonna come back after I have all of these ready. Okay guys, I think we are ready to fry. Yeah. Look at that. Look at that fry.
Okay, so I'm going to take these out. This one of them split a little bit while frying. Putting that on the plate. And we're going to take the next batch. Okay. Putting two at a time. I don't want to overcrowd it. Well, I can only fit two in there anyway. What am I talking about? Okay guys, the potatoes are done and I cut them in half, as you can see. <clears throat> so I'm gonna scoop out I'm gonna scoop out the potatoes and put in this bowl right here. So these are still kind of hot. So we have two, four, six. Okay. These are going to be good, 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 good. Oh, this one is going to be messed up, but oh well. He's kind of up. is what we have. That's what we have. Yeah, I know. I don't measure. So we have one, two, three, four. Seven or eight potatoes. So one, two, three, four. We're gonna put this whole stick of butter in there. We gotta have buttery. buttery potatoes. So I'm 
adobo because I like adobo. Some garlic powder. Some black pepper. Because we like black pepper. I'm going to put some uh, parsley in there because cause I want to. And I think that's about, about it. I'm gonna put some cheese in there. The rest of this. This is the Mexican cheese blend. Put the rest of that in there. And put some real big in it. Put that in there. Like so save that, save some for the top. If I would have had scallions, I would have put that in there. But I think I don't know if I still have it. I have some freeze dried chives. So, yeah, we can use that. Okay. We can put a little bit of milk in there if you want to stretch it out. Kind of like how you make your mashed potatoes. Pink Himalayan salt. I need to refill it. Okay. See it? So, what we will do is scoop back Oops. into 